la 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 <laughs> I always said I would start with song <laughs> I want to talk about the food chain and I want to talk about the fact that if you you know you look at the food chain you see the top and then it goes it's kind of like a triangular pyramid etc and I want to talk about people on our food chain <laughs> and of course us being a part of someone else's food chain which is really important and we look at the importance of what is you know you go you can put, make, create your own food chain regarding what is healthiest and you know what you should eat more of what you should eat less of and I, I want to talk about how people place value on others when it comes to a food chain and how it's possible we should be gauging our relationships um, in the same manner and <laughs> you know we want I personally eat a, personally eat a lot of fruit and I love to eat chicken I, I try to eat as clean as possible so at the top of my food chain would be uh, more whole foods or clean foods etc and at the bottom of my food chain you would find sugars and sweets and you know snacks and things like that so but I, I try to put the most importance on my whole foods which make me feel better and I think when it comes to people <laughs> it's important we kind of invest in people that have us on the same level as we have them. So I, I place importance, of course, in my husband. He's at the top of my food chain. He's, he is uh, the closest person to me at this time. And then of course, I, I have an awesome relationship with my sister. One of my sisters is my absolute best friend. I'm close with my younger sister and things like that. So she's at the top of my food chain too. And I could name a bunch of other people <laughs> who are at the top as well, who I place the most value in. And I, I, everyone in my life is valuable, but I think, of course, who I invest in most are people that I'm closest with or people I have the closest intimate relationships with. And I want to talk about um, a healthy relationship consists of those that have us on the same level on their food chain as we have and ours. And I remember prior to my husband, you know, if you dated someone or had a relationship with someone, there are times when the people we're relating to don't hold us in the same value or esteem that we hold them. So we really have to look at how balanced our relationships are and, uh, and that they're, they're reciprocal, that they're flowing, and that what we do for them is an unconditional way that we're kind of receiving the same watering that we're giving to them. And I'm not talking about finances or things like that, but just where they are available to us in the same manner we are available to them. You know, we all go through our challenges and our hard times. And there are times when sometimes I have to talk more about things because maybe there are situations I'm going through that are unpleasant and I just need my friends to talk to. But then I have to remember also to make time for them when they're struggling. And if I am, if let's just say, I, you know, I, I outlet and I talk with someone and then when they call me, if I don't make myself available in the same manner, I'm not putting the same importance on them and I'm not... I'm not including them in my food chain at the same level. So all I wanted to talk about was think about the people in your food chain, the ones you hold with the highest esteem and the ones you're acquaintances with and so on and so forth. But also think about the, the conversations you have. I've been around people who the conversation is basically about them. And when you try to intervene, give feedback, try to have it be a back and forth conversation if you find them simply going back to talking about themselves and not really reciprocating in a conversation it's probably not someone that is 
as considerate as you were someone, it wouldn't be someone that I would be able to um, talk with very often because if, if it's not balanced, <laughs> eventually it's going to be at the point where they don't really know much about you and maybe that's just the way they are. So I wanted to talk about that, talk about the food chain. Think about the people that you hold in the highest esteem at the top of your food chain. Those are the people should, that should have you at the top of their food chain. <laughs> and if not, if they don't, maybe you can move them to the next level down. Maybe it's something you consume once in a while or consume on a very rare basis. <laughs> so just think about it. Sit back right down and think about it. So that's what I wanted to talk about. Look at your food chain, look at your relationships and you'll you'll balance them out and everything will work out just fine. So that's it. I'll talk with you soon. Bye-bye.